Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be doing the Winterlicious tag. So I have my questions right here on my laptop and I'm going to go ahead and just get started. So the first question is, what is your favorite winter nail polish? And I have a lot of different favorites probably for the winter. I like to kind of go darker with my nail polish, but I also like to wear, of course, reds and maroons. So my probably favorite for this year is definitely going to be Bogata Blackberry, and this is by OPI. It's a really gorgeous, like, maroon, shimmery color. It has, like, gold shimmer flecks in it, and I just love it because it's, like, red, but it's a little bit more, like, vampy and, like, nighttime-y. So it's work for, like, Christmas parties, and it also would work for, like, New Year's because it's sparkly. And this is just, like, my favorite winter nail polish. It also looks kind of dark on your nails, but then it's kind of, like, a reddish maroon color, which is always really in and, um, like, a big trend for the winter this year. The next question is, what's your favorite lip product for the winter time? And mine would be Chapstick, but I felt like that was kind of like boring, but I absolutely have to have chapstick during the winter, especially when it's really cold and dry. It just, I hate having chopped lips. So definitely chapstick, but since that's kind of a boring answer, I wanted to show like an actual lip product. And this is actually the Revlon and what is it called? The Revlon Colorburst Lip Gloss in the color Fire. And it is a bright, gorgeous cream red. I love this. It's super, super opaque. I would put it on, but it's so bright and intense. Um, that I guess I'll save it for another video so you guys can see what it looks like. But um, this is what the applicator looks like. It's a nice doe fit applicator. It's really creamy and glossy and it's super, super opaque. So instead of wearing a red lipstick, I love wearing this gloss because I personally like the feeling of gloss over lipstick and this gives a beautiful red color. So this is perfect for the holidays and for any holiday look that you want to do. So that's definitely my favorite um, lip product and you can find this at a drugstore if you're interested in picking it up. The next question is most worn clothing piece for winter and I would have to say probably this jacket. Um, it hasn't really gotten cold yet which is a little bit disappointing but um, it, the weather in Austin fluctuates so much. Sometimes it's cold, sometimes it's hot, it really just depends. Um, I like to wear leather jackets a lot so this is one of my favorite ones. This is actually just from lulus.com. I got this like two years ago and it's just a really nice faux leather jacket. It has like a bunch of like kind of brass details and zippers and stuff and I like the shape of it. It has a really nice kind of pointed collar and everything. Um, but another jacket that I love is actually from Forever 21 and I got this probably two years ago as well and it's just a nice tweed jacket and I just think it's really classy and pretty. It reminds me of like Gossip Girl. Um, I love to wear this when I go to New York. It's also pretty heavy and so it keeps you nice and warm and it kind of has a little bit of like padding in the shoulders and it's just a really pretty tweed um, kind of printed like trench coat length style and I really love this and this is definitely something that I wear a ton once it's winter time and cold. It kind of just goes with every outfit and I feel like the tweed is really wintry in my opinion. So the next question is your favorite winter accessory. Wait, never mind. Your most worn winter accessory. And that would have to be a pair of black tights. I wear tights all the time. Um, from my latest video, you guys saw how I did a bunch of different outfits with tights and outfits that you could remove the tights if it's warm or add them if it's cold where you live. And just a great pair of like black opaque tights is definitely something that I wear all the time in the winter because I love to still wear dresses and skirts and stuff and especially with boots. Um, tights make boots go on really easily because you can just slip on over. Um, but I definitely would say for tights, at least for mine, I replace them probably every winter. Um, you can buy a few pairs that are maybe cheaper and then maybe one nicer pair, but for the most part, I tend to see that after the winter, my tights will get like a rip in them or they just will kind of start to stretch or just not feel as nice. So I definitely would recommend kind of buying a new pair of tights every winter, but if you can make them last, it's always great too. But for me, mine never really last. I always somehow end up ripping them or something. The next question is, favorite winter scent or candle? My favorite winter candle right now would definitely be the Yankee Candle Cookie Swap. This smells so good. It smells like buttery, like buttery sugar cookies. Almost like those cookies that um, you can buy at the grocery store that have like the little printed, what, the little printed Christmas trees on them and they come in like little round um, circles and you can just put them in the oven. I don't remember like who they're made by or anything, but this is exactly what this smells like. It just smells like those really nice sugar cookies and I love the smell of that and that really scents my whole room. So I love that it has a really nice scent throw and it makes everything just smell like a little bakery. And the next question is what's your favorite winter beverage? And I have a very boring answer for this. I'm sorry 
but I don't like like hot chocolate or any eggnog or just like anything like winter themed I guess um, I pretty much only drink water and Diet Coke I really don't drink anything else other than that so I don't have a favorite winter beverage I'm sorry the next question is all-time favorite Christmas holiday movie and the first one that comes to my head would be Home Alone. For some reason, I always end up watching Home Alone with my sisters and my parents on Christmas Eve. I feel like it's just always on TV on Christmas Eve and we all like go in the living room and like put on our pajamas and watch it. Um, but I feel like that's not necessarily like a super Christmassy movie. I mean, it's set during Christmas time, but I don't know if that would count. So another one that I love to watch is The Grinch, How the Grinch Stole Christmas. And that's why I actually did that Cindy Lou Who hairstyle. Um, a lot of people were confused on that video. I was not saying that you should like wear that to like a normal party. Um, here at least where I live, a lot of people have like themed parties. So they want you to like dress up as something or kind of wear something a little bit more wild than you'd wear at like a normal party. So that was actually a hairstyle that some of my friends actually wore to a themed party that you were supposed to like dress up and kind of put a little bit more like effort and like make it a little funny I guess but a lot of people were commenting on that video being like what are you wearing this is crazy but yeah it was for like a theme party so I guess I should have like made that more clear so people didn't think like oh you should wear this to like your Christmas dinner or something but yeah The Grinch Stole Christmas is definitely one of my favorite movies I like the cartoon but I really prefer the one with Jim Carrey I think it's just I don't know I love that movie it's just so beautifully like everything in that movie is like beautiful I just I love watching that Number eight is your favorite Christmas or holiday song. Again, I feel like I have a bad answer for this. I don't really like Christmas music all that much, um, but my favorite like overall Christmas song would probably be like, I don't know, like Carol of the Bells, I think. Just because when I was in like elementary school, um, we had our like, I think it was the high school choir came and like sang that, and it was just really beautiful. And I remember just being there like as like a little third grader and being like so impressed with how well they could sing. And I don't know. As of now, that's like remained one of my favorite Christmas songs. It's kind of like intense and like when I was younger, I used to think it was kind of like a scary song, but um, overall, I like it. Number nine is your favorite holiday treat, and mine would be those cookies that I was referencing to. I'm sure someone will comment what they're called down below, but they're the little sugar cookies that you buy at the grocery store that are like ready to be baked. They're already cut, and you just put them in the oven, and I just love those. I love sugar cookies in general. I don't really like chocolate, so that would definitely be my pick, or my grandpa always makes these caramels, and he like makes them, and he has like this secret recipe that he's never like shared with me, so either those caramels that he makes or the cookies that you can buy at the grocery store that have like the little printed um, Christmas trees on them. Number 10, what is your favorite Christmas decoration this year? Probably my little tree that I have back here. And on here, I really love this little sparkly reindeer ornament. I think it's so cute. Um, and I probably will do like maybe a more in-depth room tour showing you guys all my Christmas decorations and stuff and like explaining where I got stuff if you guys would be interested in that. Um, I want to decorate this filming room a little bit more too. So if you guys would like a tour of this um, kind of when it's all decorated for Christmas, let me know and I can definitely do that. The next question is, what is at the top of your Christmas list? And the top of my Christmas list would be probably a pair of nice earrings. Um, I just recently got my ears pierced, which I've showed you guys. And if you've been a follower of my channel for a long time, you know that I have been putting that off for about three years, ever since I started YouTube. I've been saying I was going to get my ears pierced, but I just never did. So probably just a really nice pair of earrings, maybe something meaningful. Um, I have those earrings that have like the angel wings and they're from Forever 21, but I've had people say that sometimes it's not good to wear earrings that aren't like nice quality because it can irritate your ears and stuff. So maybe just like a nice pair of like meaningful earrings. Number 12, what are your plans for the holidays this year? Well, I definitely will be in Dallas. Um, I have a lot of family that lives in Dallas, so we'll probably visit them. So if you are in Dallas, maybe I'll see you around. And then other than that, probably just hanging out with my friends and family. Um, one of my good friends is having a big party for New Year, so that should be fun. And I'm just overall really excited for Christmas. I love Christmas time. It's obviously like one of the best times of the year. And if you guys like me to do like some vlogs and stuff over Christmas break, I definitely will try to. And um, yeah, hopefully you guys can look forward to that. So those are all the questions. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all have a wonderful and safe holiday season. And if you guys would like to do this tag, I would love to see it. And you can go ahead and leave it as a video response, or you can answer the questions in the comments below. And I hope to see you guys very soon. Bye, everyone.